My brother and I really didn't decide, make a decision to sell the property. But people knew that it, we had it and that we were not going to be able to maintain it. I did have a phone call from a fellow who wanted to buy it. I said, what are you going to do with it? He said, well, we'll make it into a clubhouse and put a golf course or two on it. No way. So, with the interest of the National Trust showed and historic Charleston Foundation provided, we made that decision, and that's one of the great decisions we've made. I remember being eternally grateful to my father and his brother for making the decision to turn Drayton Hall over to the National Trust. Grateful because it was a decision made by your head, not your heart. And I tend to live by my heart and not my head. So I think it was the right decision. And I will always appreciate that that very difficult decision was not laid on my shoulders. It's okay. The house is where it needs to be. It is being preserved, it is being cared for, where no single family, even no amount of money, could be poured into this and save it the way it has been. And it's been open to the public and shared. <laughs>